So how'd it go at the clinic? Fine at first, but then there was a complication. We have decided against the procedure. Really? Why? Because it's killing babies, Brian. If God wanted us to kill babies, he'd make them all Chinese girls. Peter, it's not a baby. It's a fertilized egg. It's the size of the tip of a pin. It's alive, isn't it? To kill any living thing is an abortion. That's what the man I just met outside the clinic told me. And he had a t-shirt on that confirmed it. Okay, well, sperm is alive, and every time you masturbate, millions of them die. So is it wrong to kill sperm? Yes. Yes, it is. From now on, no more masturbating in this house. W w what? Why? Because masturbation is abortion. But abortion helps me get my homework done. And sometimes I abort in my sleep. What am I supposed to do about that? Peter, I'm sorry if you disagree with me, but according to the law, it is still my right to choose what I do with my body. Well, the law is wrong, Lois. Okay, Peter, if you're so pro-life, let me ask you this. Would you go down to the orphanage and claim an unwanted baby and take care of it? No, Lois, I'm here to save the unborn. Once they get out of the vagina, they can go fuck themselves. Peter, what's inside of Lois won't be remotely human for six months. There's no brain activity until at least the 27th week. It's still a person, Brian. It's a woman's responsibility to carry it to term. Well, what if a woman is raped? Maybe she should have thought of that before she asked me for directions. Huh? What about incest, Peter? What's incest? You know how Cousin Lou has that kid whose eyes touch? So what, you saying touch eyes doesn't deserve to exist? Boy, you don't mind them when you want a needle threaded. I'm just saying that they should have at least had the option. How can you say that? Think of all the love he's given to Uncle Mom and Aunt Dad. Okay, this argument isn't working. Peter, what if carrying the baby to term would endanger the mother's life? I don't know what seven of those words were. What if you look at the ultrasound and see that the baby's going to be born with no arms and no legs? You name it, Matt. Peter, I honestly don't care what you say. I am going back to that clinic, and I'm having that abortion. Oh, no, you're not. Oh, yes, I am. Now you get out of my way. Lois, you go down there, and I'll blow the place up. You wouldn't. You've seen Family Guy. You know I would. Oh, so what? You, you, you'd kill a bunch of doctors to show them that killing is wrong? Does that make sense to you, Peter? Well... Does it? I 